Hello students and family members. In today's tech tool video, I'm going to teach you how to log in to the Smoketown 4th grade Blabberize page and create your first blabber, just like Mr. Panza did at the top of the page. First step, click on the Smoketown Blabberize link. It is going to take you to this Blabberize login page. If you forget the username and password, go back to the Smoketown page Look at the picture that gives you the information for username and password. The username is ST4thGrade. The password is students. So when I'm back here, I click in username and I type in ST4thGrade, password, all lowercase, students. Then click login. It may take a little bit to log in, but once it does, here's what you'll see. And there may be other students that have posted some videos here too, but you're all set to make a new video. First, click Make. Once you click Make, it will log in and show you, or prompt you, I should say, to find a picture. To do that, we suggest that you save a picture to your desktop or somewhere where you know you can easily find it. That way when you click on browse, you can then find your picture, I'll take one of my daughter here, and immediately upload it to the Blabber page. Then click this next button which is the blue arrow. Now you're ready to set up your mouth. That's this red piece right here. Place it over the mouth where you'd like to be speaking. Make sure you are not crossing over because then it's not going to look like a mouth. You want to try and outline the mouth the best that you can. This takes time and you may have to redo it a couple of times before you get what you're looking for. I want to make sure that it's underneath the teeth so it actually looks like she's talking. And this green dot here is how low her lip can actually go. When you're satisfied with the mouth, you click the next blue arrow. Now you're ready to record a sound. You could have a previous recording, but it's easier to just use the microphone. So click the mic to record. When you do that, it's going to ask you to allow or deny access of your computer microphone. You want to go ahead and click allow. Now you'll see that the mouth is ready to move. As you are set to record, click the record button to start recording and the record button to stop recording. So let's try it out. Hi, my name is Leah Panza. My daddy taught me how to make this blabberize, and now you get to use it too. Have lots of fun! Once it's done, this blue link will be active. Click Next. If you want to watch back, you can hit play, or if you're satisfied, click OK. You can save it, edit it, or make another scene. I want to save it, and it's going to make you add a title, a description, as well as some tags. You must have all of them. So I'm going to title this Leah's Intro. It's an introduction to Blabber, and tag would be intro, comma, Blabber eyes. Then click Save. And because you've already logged in, it's going to save it directly to the Smoketown Blabber eyes page, which your teachers and students can go back and watch them right here on the Smoketown Blabber eyes page, where we also plan to possibly save them to the site a little bit later. It may take a moment or two to save, but once it does, you'll get taken to this page where you can rewatch your video like this. Hi, my name is Leah Panza. My daddy taught me how to make this blabberize, and now you get to use it too. Have lots of fun! At this point, you're done. You can just X out or log out, and then one of the teachers will come in and share it. I hope you enjoy this tool as much as I have teaching it to you.